Hello, this is a first course in abstract algebra by Johnson. In this video, we're going to take a really quick look at this book. So let's open it up and see what it contains. A first course in abstract algebra by Richard E. Johnson. Here's the copyright. So the first printing was in 53. Wow. This one is from 65. So this is the seventh, seventh printing. And then here are the contents. Starts with basic concepts, the real number system, integral domains and fields, polynomial domains, complex number field, and then groups. And here we have vector spaces, linear transformations and matrices, linear equations and determinants, and then we have other algebraic systems. And this book um, is pretty good. It doesn't have, uh, doesn't have answers in the back, but it does have uh, a good index. Here we can see who's checked it out, or at least when it was checked out. This is really cool. Wow. And then here, there's this, and then what's this? It's a library card people's names and stuff. Wow. Crazy. Look at the dates. Uh, we don't know what year these, this was. 60s? This is in the 60s. Crazy. History, right? Really nuts. But this is a solid textbook. Um, uh, you know, it's, I, I would say that there are easier ones. Uh, the fact that it doesn't have answers makes it tough to learn. Like, if, you just, if it's just you in the book, it's pretty tough. But... Um, as a collector, I'm, I'm happy I have a copy. So, yeah. Anyways, I'll leave a link in the description in case you want to check it out. And, yeah. I also have an abstract algebra course. Uh, it's on Udemy, but if you get it, just use the links from my website, mathsorcerer.com. I've got tons of math courses. Check them out. Take care.